My name is Alan Thompson. I'm the Global Sustainable Finance and ESG Offering Leader for IBM Consulting. I'm also a EU Climate Pact Ambassador. We talk to clients and understand where they are in their sustainability journeys to date, how they baseline and measure their performance with regards to their own indicators on sustainable finance, and how we can actually leverage from their data, normalize and transform that into insights which can be actionable for themselves, for their own clientele. This is not just about making a, a transaction, but really taking that accountability and responsibility. We're on a trajectory, according to the IPCC, that if we don't reach peak emissions by 2025, which is obviously literally just around the corner, we're on a pathway of irreversible change. So these scenario bases of 1.5 degrees or 2 degrees by the end of uh, the century, it's not just uh, uh, hearsay or fact versus fiction, it really will have meaningful impact because this will happen in the next decade. Two thirds of the world GDP is um, dependent on nature to date, but the fact is that we have less than 1% of it that's actually protecting nature in terms of uh, restoration or pre um, preventative measures. So you realise very, very quickly that there will be a domino effect from nature and in terms of biodiversity degradation, water scarcity, obviously climate change itself in terms of the temperature rises. I think it's not just paramount, it's fundamental to everyone's livelihood that we address this and sustainable finance is absolutely key in playing that by channeling funds and investments in the right direction. Therefore, I think I would welcome more marketplaces, whether it's regarding nature and whether it's regarding societal, as to how we can actually provide valuations and assetize that so we can actually make meaningful impact and change, not just for the, this generation of lifetime, but for the next generation's lifetime, and that's preserved and not just as a one-off activity. So I'd welcome more dialogue of that ilk and transparency for everybody involved from indigenous populations to us sitting here right now in London in the Square Mile.